Go yeah, faggot so. lovers. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so it's uh, a, li a little bit unfair to to say that uh, we don't uh, we 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 want the Arabs here or the Muslims here. Yeah, but it's like an insult. You know, if you think about all the demonstrations that we have had over the years, like yeah. was it Bolnas? They had a big demonstration against a rape, gang rape, where yeah. was there a father that died because he fought back? I don't know, someone died. Someone was like stabbed to death for... I don't know, my memory is a bit foggy, but it, you had a... I, I can't say we because I wasn't a member back then. But I'll say we anyway for simple simpleness. Like with, yeah, but, uh, but this was in, in the beginning of the... Of the to two thousands mm. like 2004 or, or then we have the de demonstration against the the uh, invasion of, of foreigners mm. in sweden and sweden democrats did not no and it's like uh, it's so dishonest to be in our chats and comments and uh criticize us using these arguments because they're obviously false like we love arabs and uh, we want them to rape our women like we don't understand yeah. that having racial strangers in our country has caused all the problems that we see mm -hmm. and that all of our media and all of our propaganda is aimed towards remedying this fact and they they can't like people call it holding two thoughts in your brain at the same time. I don't know if that's what it is really, because I think it's the same thought that uh, we want Hamas to wipe Israel off the face of the planet so that they can live in peace in their own fucking country so we can send them back there and they can live there and have Islam in their own country. I mean, that's yeah. a good start. I mean, and if they're not going to go willingly, we're going to force them to go back there. That's how it's going to work. Yeah, yeah and all, all these uh, immigrants we have here, uh, like the I Iraqis, uh, mm. they are the, the biggest immigration group. Uh, I don't know if there is a million. <laughs> Maybe. Isn't it Syrians? Yeah, then we have the Syrians. Mm. Um, now nah, I think the Iraqis is, is the biggest. The Syrians, a few, oh, that's like four years ago, they're, they're the biggest minority in Sweden. Okay. But yeah. that's that's only because they registered as Syrians when they fled, you know, back in yeah, yeah, many of them 16. Aren't, aren't uh, Syrians, yeah, yeah exactly. No. But we have this uh, really big immigration groups uh, uh, in Sweden mm. that, uh, they, yeah, well, they're raping women. They they have control of some areas in Sweden, some ghettos, no go areas. <clears throat> And they are all here because of Israel and USA. They are all here uh, because they bombed their countries and then they got the refugee status. So they could go here legally. Just uh, come here, uh, get your get your citizenship and, uh, and stay. And uh, so Israel and the US uh, supporting Israel to, to uh, combating their enemies uh, every year, every constantly, they are the problem. We must uh, take them out of the equation. Because, uh, well, in, that, in, in, in this case, we will uh, probably have refugees, more refugees from, from Gaza going to Sweden. Mm, yeah, exactly. Course. But in the long run, uh, uh, we must stop uh, the Israel-US uh, alliance in the Middle East <clears throat> because they, they won't quit. Uh, no. Because Israel wants a greater Israel. Yeah. And, and they will, they will uh, now they are involved with the Palestinians, but after that, they want to continue with the Syrians and go after Iran and, and, and the other countries. And then there will be more refugees uh, going here. Yeah, because that's the goal. It's not because that's what needs to be done. That's what they are aiming to do. 
Like if they if we don't disturb their business of replacing us in our own countries, they're gonna continue. And what? Yeah, what and I, yeah, go on. Yeah, it's I like uh, <laughs> the expression in Swedish: "Två flugor i en smäll." Mm. Uh, two, two flies, flies in one in... swat. Is it a? No, a that's not. That's that's the yeah. literal translation. Yeah. Yeah, because they want to go, to get rid of the Arabs from their their uh, sphere. Yeah. And and they they want them also to go to Europe to replace us. Mm. So it's a win-win for them. Yeah, and I know uh, uh, National Justice Party uh, Mike Painovich has written a long article about uh, Israel's involvement in uh, the N all the NGOs that they have created to receive refugees on the shores of Europe and bring them into Europe. And Israel is a big one. There's some other names that I don't remember, but there's literally dozens of these. Why do they exist? Like you have to ask yourself, why, why don't they work so hard to make it nice for refugees in Israel? If it's so important to help refugees, why can't they live in Israel? And I, our audience know the answer, uh, so you don't have to uh, send in super chats answering that question. <laughs> you can if you want to, but a lot of people don't understand this, that Jews are leftists in white countries, but they're ultra-nationalists in Israel. Isn't that strange? You know, they, they can't get it through the thick head that Israel is the only country on the planet that's allowed to be homogenous and have racial policies and have a big fucking wall and super security to keep people out. And they can shoot Eritreans. When they demonstrate, they just fucking shoot them, you know? We have to take care of them when they demonstrate. We have to go out and put out the fires and, you know, make sure they have enough uh, biscuits and milk <laughs> when they're done looting, you know? Oh, man. So it's really frustrating. I don't know. It's not even an IQ thing. I don't know why people aren't just seeing the blatant uh, hypocrisy here. The, discrepancies I don't know have you, do you have any thoughts on that uh, regarding what but like some people in the nationalist sphere sphere sometimes they just yeah. say fear in, in our say, sphere or in the broader in the broader ones they say like yeah I I like Israel because they're nationalists you know, in Israel, I, I, I'm envious of their wall and I'm envious of their policies, you know, stuff like that. But they still can't see that they're leftists in our countries to bring refugees in. And then they're ultra nationalists in, in their own country to protect themselves. But we're not allowed to be like that. All right, then three minutes, come strikes.
Att göra allt i vår makt för att ändra utvecklingen. För att skicka hem främlingarna och bygga en ny stat. En bättre stat. En vit nordisk stat. Och om det skulle behövas ett skenhal, då är vi där och deltar. Om det behövs utom parlamentarism. Eller om det så väl behövs en blodig revolution så kommer vi att ta till alla medel som behövs för att försöka den vita rasens existens. Kan! 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 Storhets revolution! Storhets revolution! Storhets revolution! Storhets revolution!